Hey Primary 6 Math Rogers, this is Coach Seifel with your daily dose of math mastery. So, we're on to speed. We're going to speedily move ahead right now with the yesterday's question, alright? Yesterday's question said that, let's take a look here, in a car race, car A, blah 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 blah, and what was the difference in speed between the two cars? The answer, if you're waiting for it, is 60 kilometers per hour, and if you got it right, high five, you are a math prodigy. Good job. Now, some people got the answer of, let me write this for you, one kilometer per minute, which is also right. So if you got your right, high five, you are a math prodigy. I just forgot to tell you what you need to, to put your answers in, <laughs> okay? So if you, if you put one kilometer per minute or you put 60 kilometer per hour, it's the same thing. Why? Let's give you a little lesson here on why this is the same. This is actually the same as this. Why? Because how many minutes are there in an hour? 60 minutes, right? So in other words, we are also saying 60 kilometers per hour is actually 60 kilometers per 60 minutes. Correct? Get it or not? This hour is actually the same as 60 minutes. So, if you want to get it in a per minute format, you just take 60 divided by 60 and then you will get 1 kilometer per minute which is actually the same as this get it so if you got it good job okay now let's know let's find out how to do this question it looks like a pretty difficult question but it isn't actually okay the first thing is you need to understand car a took 20 minutes to cover the distance of 60 kilometers so how do you find out what is its speed in for example kilometers per hour okay first off um, speed of a okay equals to what? What is speed equals to? D over T, remember? Distance over time. So the distance is what? The distance is actually equals to 60 kilometers. And what is the time equals to? The time is equals to 20 minutes. So, let's do this step by step. I don't want to confuse you. Let's put it in terms of minutes first. But remember, you must put the unit at the side. So 20 minutes. What is 60 divided by 20? You cancel off, you cancel off, you get 3 kilometers per minute. And if I, I tell you, okay, please change it to kilometer per hour. What do you do? Now it's per minute. If you want to change to hour, remember, uh, in an hour, how many minutes are there? There are 60 minutes. So you times 60. So you get six, uh, 3 times 60 equals to 180 kilometer per hour. And that is speed of car A. Speed of car B. All you have to do is write in the same formula of D over T. And what is, the, yeah, what is it in this case? It is, uh, Kabi took 15 minutes to cover the same distance. So 60 kilometers over 15 minutes. What's 60 divided by 15? You will get 4. So you write down here, equals to 4 kilometer per minute, which equals to what? How many per hour? What? Times 60, correct. So 60 times 4 equals to? 240 kilometers per hour. So what is the difference between 240 and 180? 240 minus 180 will give you the answer of 60 kilometers per hour. Very simple. And that is the answer. If you got it right, one more time, give yourself a high five. You are a math prodigy. Good job. So let's move on to the next question. Ma uh, speed is something that you should be speedily moving forward against, uh, towards, sorry. And make sure that it's very, very simple. Make sure that you make it as easy as, as, as possible. Don't make it complicated with the units. Just remember, one hour has 60 minutes. One kilometer has 1,000 meters. It's very simple to convert, okay? So now, the next question looks a bit more realistic. Okay, imagine you live in a flat. And in your flat, the lift at block A, at your block, can travel from the first floor to the ninth floor in two minutes, which I think is pretty slow. <laughs> so if the distance between each floor is 2 meters, find the speed of the lift in kilometers per hour. Alright, you have been warned. Kilometers per hour. So with that, that is the last question of the week. And I want you to remember one last thing. Please, line by line, the answer is mine. Do it step by step, line by line, the answer is mine. With that, this is Coach Saifu signing off. You are a math prodigy. Good job.